passengers, 72 Whitesburg, about 67 in Rockwood. Your forecast for the rest of uh, this afternoon shows us this severe storm risk that we have here. We're in the slight category for many of us. That's a level two from La Follette back over to Knoxville, and it gets a little calmer as you get over into Johnson City, looking at the primary threat to be some gusty winds, which could bring down some trees and power lines, and of course, creating some problems and inconvenience for you if you lose power. 83 degrees for the two o'clock hour. It's nice and sticky. It's humid as we try to see some of that sunshine build back in. We're at 90 for the afternoon high. Here's the forecast where you live showing a couple of those raindrops that stay through the one o'clock hour. 90 in Knoxville to 88 Pigeon Forge, 90 Kingston. Down to the south we go. How about 88 Sweetwater to Etowah, 89 for Madisonville. We warm to around 88 in Crossville to 87 in Jamestown, Middlesbrough, Tazewell, 88 for Maynardville. Finally, 88 Newport to Hartford as well, Dandridge, 88 Pigeon Forge and 75 at the base of the Great Smoky Mountains. Maybe you're going to grill out this evening. We'll dodge a couple of showers, but some of you will be able to get things on the grill and get it off. 85 is where we're going to be right at that sunset tonight at 856. So let's look at the rest of the afternoon. Four o'clock is relatively calm. We've got some clouds. Filtered sunshine is what we'll call it. We'll keep that mix of sun and clouds with us. Then we get into the late evening hours, and that's when we trigger the first alert weather day for round two of the storms that come through. Some heavy downpours at times in Crossville to Jamestown, moving right on through to the midnight hour, pushing over to the east from Gatlinburg back over into Maryville. Once again, uh, picking up a good amount of rain in some of these locations where we have some of these heavy downpours. Starting to clear it out a little bit as we head into Saturday morning. We'll leave a few raindrops in the forecast for the start of the day. So overnight tonight, scattered to spotty showers and storms. We're going to get to around 70, so we stay a little warm with the uh, clouds that are overhead. And you see here we keep rain chances with us right on through the weekend and the early part of next week. We got that coverage right at 40% for you before pulling it back to around 20% for your Tuesday. So it might look messy here, uh, but it won't rain every minute of the day. So opportunities to get out and do things over the weekend leading right on into the July 4th holiday. 87 on Monday, back to 88 for July 4th on your Tuesday. A little clearer, warm sunshiner with this back.